Okay, YouTube, this is Gas Stove Part 3. As you can see, the stove is now being finished. It's been painted. A matte black stove paint. It's turned out quite well. I'd like to apologise for the poor quality on the other videos. I was just uploading off an Android phone, it wasn't very good. So, hopefully, this one will make everything clearer. So once again, the base of the gas cylinder, cut in half and welded on, with the legs, gate hinge, window latch, and I fabricated my own vent for the air. It's a bolt welded on, works quite nice. I have a 3 inch bus exhaust as the chimney, about 10 foot of pipe which rises to a 45 degree bend through the wall and another foot to take it above the apex of the garage. I was worried that this exhaust wouldn't draw well enough but it draws quite well actually. I think it's because of the length of pipe and a fairly gradual bend as opposed to a sharp bend. The exhaust is welded on. It was a nice weld, but just in case, I actually came across a good product. It's Holtz Gun Gun. It's actually for exhausts, so it fits in with the bus exhaust. But it actually gives a gas tight seal just in case there were any leaks. It's quite useful and it's quite cheap. You can use stove cement, but I already had this, so I tried it and it works well. The uh, stove paint I used, I'll just show you. It's actually Rustin's heat resistant black paint. I gave it two coats just to be sure. And it turned out quite nice, and I'm very happy with it.